Now to Washington tonight and a demand for answers on a new symbol of incompetence and waste of taxpayer dollars. It is in Afghanistan. It is gigantic and it has never been used. So what is it? ABC's chief global affairs correspondent Martha Raddatz tells us. It is a monumental symbol of waste in Afghanistan, the butt of jokes among Marines, as big as a football field with fine furnishings, spacious conference rooms, theater seating, and offices fit for a corporate executive. Your tax dollars, 34 million of them at work. It's better than the Pentagon. I have never seen a building better uh, constructed than this, and we're gonna destroy it. That's right, you heard the inspector general destroy it. Bad enough to spend millions of dollars on this kind of building in a war zone, but even more outrageous when you consider this. It has never been used. A Marine Corps commander asked that the project be halted long before it started, and it will likely be demolished before our troops leave because it is too expensive for Afghans to even operate. What this epitomizes is what we've seen in Afghanistan time and again. If you appropriate it, we will spend it, even if we don't need it. But getting to the root of a bad decision is difficult. I called the Air Force, and now they told me to call the Office of the Secretary of Defense. The matter is uh, currently under investigation. And who's investigating it? Uh, U.S. Forces Afghanistan. Which is the answer you will get from Afghanistan. They are investigating. But the project is just one more example of taxpayer waste in America's longest war. We could get anything we wanted, said one officer. It was insane. Martha Raddatz, ABC News, Washington.